Okay, so this is part one of doing a formal entrance into your home. So I would say it's more like the the romantic sort of um, entrances that you used to get like in Versailles and those sort of places, you know, where you do a formal hedge next to your path, you do a very clear distinct pathway, you soften it with some roses coming in. So if you look at this home, you know, you can see everything about it sort of screams for that that sort of look and feel you know and that's what the owners like as well so initially here they only had a lawn section here at the top and then it slopes down quite considerably down to the left hand side so what we decided to do here is to first of all retain it on the left hand side with the retaining wall you know so that we can get the top level a hundred percent level through here leading up to the front or we're going to put a water feature there as a central focal point with a pathway leading up down the middle okay so you can see the foundations that's been thrown all the way around and that leads all the way around here with a smooth curve that will then join up to the back area there okay so this whole area here at the top against the home will now be leveled out because formal gardens has got to be level that's the one key thing you know you can't do a formal pattern on a slope then what we're doing is we we linking it to a more informal section with more informal planting down at the bottom you know because we've got this existing oak tree that's enormous here we want to create a little seating area underneath the tree there and then fill this up with some nice planting with a little informal pathway going through there so then over here you will see eventually we're putting steps going down here so steps will lead you down here with a pathway going through and then an additional set of steps will come down here into that section all right and these two pathways will link up to one another and over here we're going to have a nice formal pathway coming through we're going to be doing urns on top of columns so i think it's going to look very nice